How Caterpillar uses data to save millions of dollars. Let's look at Caterpillar's marine division. They basically serve ship operators that operate fleets of tugboats and ships, container ships. One of the biggest costs for those operators is fuel. The second most important cost is what they call a hull clean, where every two years they have to take the ship out of the water and clean the hull. So basically, if the boat has been in the water for two years, you get lots of deposits like barnacles, seaweed, salt, that will hang on to the side of the ship and actually make the ship go slower, fuel consumption goes up, so every two years they now want to they clean the boat and hopefully drive performance. What Caterpillar wanted to do is they wanted to use data to optimize this. They wanted to see, can we actually do this less frequently? Because every two years, big costs. Can we maybe do this every three years? So what they did is they collected data on fuel consumption, on speed, on performance, before and after the hull cleans. Interestingly enough, what they found is that a clean hull made such a difference in terms of speed and fuel consumption that they ended up doing the hull clean every six months now. And by doing it, they're saving $400,000 per ship per year. So this for me is a great case study, using actually data to drive decision making. They did something similar with some of their container ships that have refrigerated containers. So again, they crunched the data to say, what's the, what's the impact? How can we optimize the energy that we generate in our generators to power the cooling units of those containers? And again, they were able to tweak the generator a little bit, so it was still generating enough cooling power to, gener to keep the containers cool, but would just reduce the energy consumption a little bit. And this was a $30 per hour savings. So you think this is not massive, but these operators have multiple ships, these run 24 hours a day across the year, and actually, again, this generated a $650,000 uh, savings per year. And this is, for me, what data-driven decision-making is all about, identifying what are the big ticket items in your business? Where do you spend a lot of money? Where would you like to drive efficiencies? And like Caterpillar, they looked at fuel consumption, the hull cleans, the two big ticket items for them, and they use data to really drive performance and improve efficiencies. If you would like to learn more, head to my website at bernardmar.com where you can find tons of articles, white papers and videos that will give you a lot more insights into real-world case studies and examples.